Somewhere in a remote part of Russia, Tamara, the goat is being herded towards his fate. Inside of the enclosure is Webster, one of the most fearsome predators in this world. Amr, a three-year-old Siberian tiger, stalks the goat with cold, menacing precision. But then just as Tamara is about to become a meal, something incredible happens. The story of these two unusual animals began in November of this year. What should have been a regular meal for the tiger took a surreal turn. Before then, the tiger had followed a fairly conventional regimen for a carnivore. Amr, the endangered Siberian tiger, had its diet supplemented with live prey. A Russian director of a nature park told reporters that their tigers have been living better since they started feeding them live prey. Amr, the tiger in the story, seemed to like eating this new arrangement. He went on to explain that the tiger had never previously hesitated when it came to killing and eating even large goats. But when plucky Tamara came round for dinner, everything changed. Also, if you've not done so already, please subscribe to our channel and click that notification bell to get inspired by these animal stories every day. Now, back to the story. It soon became apparent that this was one main course which wasn't going to be easy to swallow. The goat was very brave recalled Mezenstev. He flashed his horns or retaliated every time a miner attacked. When goats display their horns in this way, they are trying to assert their dominance. And while that might seem a crazy thing to do when facing an opponent as fearsome as a tiger, Tamara Gamble seemed to pay off. The wary tiger was confused, said Mezenstev stuff. He decided not to mess with the goat. Keepers at the zoo believed that because Tamara had never encountered a tiger before he had never learned to be afraid of them. And while such a theory goes against what most experts believe about the instinctive behavior in animals, it could go some way to explaining what happened next. Amazingly Amr didn't just decide to spare the goat, he actually became friends with it. In the weeks since their first tense encounter, the two have taken to living peacefully together in the tiger's enclosure. They say a leopard can't change its spots, but Amr seems to be a tiger capable of changing his stripes. Tamara follows, a mirror everywhere explained Mezenstev and the tiger quietly tolerate it. In fact, according to a blog entry posted by the park on November 26, Cheeky Tamara even booted Amr out of his sleeping place. While the goat made himself at home in the tiger's comfortable hut, the predator was relegated to sleeping on the roof. Thankfully, Amr seems to have taken the affront in his stride and the two are regularly seen enjoying strolls around the enclosure in each other's company. In fact, it seems that the unlikely duo have developed quite a strong bond. Some sources report that park officials attempted to remove Tamara from the enclosure only for a mirror to work constantly until his companion was returned. The goat, on the other hand, is said to become anxious when his tiger friend is out of his sight. Amr's friendship with the goat seems to be broadening his taste too. The tiger, who in the wild would have enjoyed a strictly carnivorous diet of large herbivores such as Tamara, has even been spotted sampling some of Tamara's salt brick, a nutrient source intended solely for hoofed animals. Many people have speculated about the reasons behind this unusual friendship, while some claim that Amr's time in captivity has made him lazy and dulled his predatory instincts. Others claim that the companionship is only temporary. As Rostislav Shilo of Nova Suburb Sioux told news agency tasks, there is an 80 to 85% chance that the tiger will eat the goat. So, there could be an unpleasant staying in this tiger tail one day. For the time being, however, things between the two friends appear to be continuing amicably. As of the park's last update on December 6, Tiger and Goat were still playing happily together. For Tamara, who was fittingly named after the brave protagonist in a popular Soviet-era children's book, life as an equal, or perhaps even as superior to one of the world's most fearsome animals, is certainly better than ending up as lunch, even if it isn't meant to last.